All right, guys, Rick Kern, the Scaly Dad here at Scaly Adventures, and I'm here today at Monkey Island Rescue and Midwest Tongs, the manufacturer of the world's best snake handling equipment. And I'm here with the owner and founder, Dana Savarelli, good friend of mine, great supporter of Scaly Adventures, actually provided us with our closed captioning for our show so that our hearing impaired uh, viewers could watch that. And we've, we are so thankful for that, for what you've done. But today we're here at your facility. We're actually in one of my favorite rooms, which is uh, um, your reptile room. And right. there's, a, there's a cobra right here. And this is so cool. The world's deadliest snake and about the world's second deadliest. Mm -hmm. We've got the Inland Taipan here and we've got the Green Mamba. So I am really having a great time. But Dana's passion is for rescuing animals in addition to making sure that people don't get hurt in the field and you see all these really cool pieces of equipment that he has here behind us this has actually come from this man's hands and this man's head and it's really really impressive to see the work you've done here so tell us a little bit about how you got started dana the animal world i don't know you know it wasn't from parents or anything like that it has mm -hmm. to be just something that maybe is, is in you uh when i got involved with snakes i was maybe four or five years old for some reason there was a passion to it it pretty well taught me how to read mm -hmm. my mom would always say you know he won't put down nothing but those the snake books is the only thing he'll read and they just said keep feeding him the snake books he'll get there mm -hmm. you know and so eventually that's that's what happened and i kept on i could memorize those books um, then it got into venomous snakes by the time I was 12 years old, which wow. seems crazy, and you shouldn't do that at home, but, you know, <laughs> I'm an old guy, that, so right? I was doing that way back then. So uh, primates, you mm -hmm. know, I had multiple primates. We didn't know how to deal with them and their attitudes and some of the stuff like we know now mm -hmm. that I wish I knew, Yeah. Uh, but but learned the hard way, and, and sometimes the hard way teaches you a lot of cool stuff. Mm -hmm. That is um, true. As I got older, uh, I got into skydiving. I got over 5,000 skydives. I taught for 15 years, had my own school, multiple airplanes. Wow. Uh, a lot of that uh, technology of, we were building helmet cameras and stuff to mm -hmm. video outside the airplane or cameras on the outside of the airplane. Yeah. And a lot of that equipment was made from very lightweight, very strong pieces of metal. Mm -hmm. And that's what we've incorporated into Midwest Tongs. High, high, high grade equipment and very lightweight. Mm -hmm. so we get uh, the best of both worlds, I guess you'd say. Well, I will tell you, it's interesting because when you grab any one of these pieces of equipment here, like this uh, gentle giant tong here, it's, it is really interesting because, uh, you know, you and I were talking off camera a few minutes ago about how some of this is so designed and handmade. Right. And, and that's the part that really goes into it that really, really impressed me about it. And you can tell the passion that goes into creating something, whether you're painting or you're right. a musician. Uh, we film with our guys at Bumble profit and things like that is like you said just that maniacal flame that keeps you up late right. at night to come up with something like this that benefits both the handler and the animal right and that's that's what makes it nice it's a two-part thing it keeps you safe which is our first priority number right. one and next is trying to keep the snake from being damaged or hurt and that comes out of a passion for caring right. for these animals. Well, we just want to thank Dana for his contribution to, you know, conservation of these important species. Because some of these animals, they're, they're extremely limited in the world. Right. And, and this is the only chance I've ever had to see an inland taipan. And so we really thank you for your passion and your compassion towards these animals. And for keeping people safe out there with these gentle <laughs> giant tongs and the other snake hooks that you see. So stay tuned to Scaly Adventures to learn more about fascinating people like my friend Dana Savarelli and the people here at Midwest Tongs and Monkey Island Rescue. Stay tuned, stay scaly, and we'll see you out in the field.